It's peak season for Southern California strawberries. The weather is perfect and so is the ripe red fruit. But as Edgar Terry surveys his Ventura County fields, he sees red ink. You're going to have to throw fruit away? Yes. We are throwing fruit away. The strawberries are ripening faster than we can harvest them. And there is a lack of farm labor to be able to harvest all the crops that we grow here in California. All this fruit I'm seeing on the ground, this is because you don't have enough workers to pick it? Yeah, yeah. This is a lot of fruit. Sure is. He can't find farm workers, even though the most productive can earn as much as $30 an hour during peak season. How many workers do you have working on this field? Right now, we have about uh, 70, we, 70, 75. We have a need for about 100 on this location. We're about 25% short today. This year, the Western Growers Association anticipates 15% fewer farm workers in California and Arizona. Those states grow half the country's produce. Most U.S. farm workers come from Mexico. The Growers Association says the workers' shortage is due to a rise in deportations and difficulties crossing the border. But there are Americans who need jobs. Why would we bring in people from other countries to well, do the work that Americans need? Even if you go back 70, 80 years, it was very, very difficult to get unemployed uh, American workers out to work on the farms. For some reason, our type of farming here in California, people thought it was beneath them to come and work in a field. Basically, 100% uh, of our workers are farm workers from across the border. He says if Washington doesn't come up with a better way to import farm labor, the U.S. will be importing more food. That's why Terry is closely watching immigration negotiations in Congress. If you could get their ear, what, what would you say to them? Come on out here and harvest strawberries for me probably be more productive than what you're doing in Washington. Still, he hopes this time all the talk in Washington bears fruit. Bill Whitaker, CBS News, Ventura, California.